With Hurricane Hannah and Ike tearing through the Turks and Caicos over a year ago, the Turks and Caicos conch farm, the only conch farm in the world, was left in ruins. And ever since, the farm has been struggling to get back up and in business. Well, good news, the conch farm may not be back in its best shape, but it is open. Uh, well, we're still not up 100% yet here at the conch farm, but we are having some production in growing conchs, yeah. Our gift shop is back open. We're all we're open for tours to the, to the guests to come in and, and see the place and support us. According to Fortune, the farm is slowly rebuilding itself as funding has come from the farm's reopening and from certain companies that have donated time and money. There are still, however, two major areas that need to be rebuilt, two buildings that were once used as conch nurseries. Fortune says finding investors is the key to rebuilding the farm and keeping it up and open. Investors. We are currently negotiating with an, uh, an investor for an investor who's interested in seeing this place like, get back up and running. Things are going uh, good so far, as I've heard from the CEO, Chuck Hess, you know. Uh, so, yeah, we're just, we just hoping, you know, we have our fingers crossed, you know, and hoping the deal come through. And that's the main thing that could put us back up where we need to be. Though the opportunity is there for the conch farm to be taking in more funding through the selling of exported conch, the decrease in the amount of conch produced this year has led to a shortage of conch, and not all of their previous clientele will be supplied with conch this year. Now, now normally we produce 1.5 million conchs annually, but not having all our buildings up and running since the hurricane and not having the fundings to get, up, get, them, get the buildings up and running 100% as normal, uh, we only did about, say, 20% really opposed to the, the 100% that we normally do annu annually. Despite the challenges ahead of them, conch farm employees are hopeful for the future and happy to have the farm up and running again, growing and educating tourists about conch. Also, a silver lining, Conk World and Grand Turk is up and running as well. Uh, Conk World Grand Turk is up and running. It's been up and running for about, what, six months now. You know, uh, we're not actually getting the feedback in and customers in from the cruise ship as we was expecting, but we're working on, you know, organizing it much better, you know, and, and getting them to come in and take the tours at the, at, at the Conk, Conk World Grand Turk.